Yo, yeah, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to root the Samsung Galaxy S5, which is running Android 5.0 Lollipop. So, a lot of people have been having problems rooting this device running Android 5.0. So, I'm just going to show you my quick, simple method. So, um, <clears throat> first thing you'll need to do is on your Samsung Galaxy S5, you'll need to go into your settings. So, you can get into your settings simply by pulling down the notifications. Selecting this little icon here, then scrolling down to where it says about device, open that up, and as you can see Android version 5.0, so just tap on the build number five times until it unlocks developer options so you should now have unlocked developer options go ahead and select it make sure this little toggle here is on then scroll down to where it says USB debugging turn that on hit OK then you can put the device down next thing you'll need to do is you'll need to download Odin so I'll leave a link to that in the description once you download it just extract it and it will create a folder like this just leave it on your desktop next thing you'll need to do is you'll need to download TWRP open recovery also um, the beta super user zip so I'll leave both of these files for you to download in the description down below so once again you'll need to download Odin w w when you download Odin it will be a zip file like this you'll just need to right click on it and extract it and it will create a folder like this then you'll just need to download Open Recovery and the Beta Super User Zip. So I'll leave a link to both of them in the description down below, along with the Odin zip file. I'll leave a link to that in the description down below. Okay, so once you've done that, you'll need to open Odin up. and this is how it looks once it's opened up then select Odin here and just open that up now on your phone you'll need to turn it off And you'll need to go into download mode so to go into download mode press volume down along with the home button and the power button and it should look something like this with a warning here then just press volume up now we're in download mode Okay, so now just connect your phone to the USB cable. Like what I'm doing here. As you can see, it's connected to USB. Now go back to Odin on your PC. Make sure it's like this this little box here where it says id.com make sure that's blue um, if it's blue that means everything's set up correctly 
Um, if it's not blue, that means you'll need to install the Samsung drivers. You can download the Samsung drivers and, ins and install them by using Samsung keys. If you've not got S Samsung keys installed, I'll leave a link to Samsung keys in the description down below. That'll provide the drivers. And um, once you install them, this section here will then turn blue. Okay, so next thing you need to do is, is select AP. So just select AP. And now you're going to look for the Open Recovery TWRP, which is this. We're going to look for that file. So I'm just going to select Desktop because I stored it on my desktop and there it is so I'm just going to hit that so make sure it looks like this open recovery dot tr on the end then you can just go ahead and hit start and as you can see it's flashing and it only takes a few seconds to flash and it should say pass there and your phone should reboot Okay, so I'm just going to wait for the phone to finish rebooting. Okay, so the phone's finished rebooting. So you can go ahead and close down Odin. Okay, so now I'm just going to reconnect my phone. Open SD card. And now I'm going to drag and drop the Super SU file. Which is this file here onto my SD card so as you can see it's on my SD card now then go ahead and close that down now you can unplug your phone close the little flap there now turn your phone off hit power off now we need to go into recovery TWRP recovery so press volume up along with the home button and the power button all at once and as you can see we've now opened up team win recovery now select install here select this little option here if you've stored it on your SD card select micro SD card here hit OK now select beta super su zip then swipe across to install okay so it's finished installing as you can see there it says successful reboot system now
Now we're just going to wait for it to boot up and we should have um, super user access. Okay, so let's see if we've got the super user app here. And as you can see here, Super SU. Now just go to the Google Play Store and download Root Checker. and install it Once it's installed, just hit open. Then select verify route. Hit grant. And as you can see, it says congratulations, root access is properly installed on this device. So now your phone is fully rooted. And you've also got a custom recovery installed so now you can go ahead and flash any rom onto your samsung galaxy s5 and also any mods or whatever so um if you don't know how to install any custom roms onto your s5 um, be sure to check my link in the description down below i'll be doing a tutorial video on how to install a custom rom so thanks for watching this video if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up also leave any comments in the comment section down below and um, if you need help with anything, leave your comments in the comment section down below and I'll be sure to reply whenever I can. Thanks for watching. I'm out. Deuces.